Hello viewers, welcome to Programming Geek. I'm here with a new tutorial that is how to add div within div in HTML. Okay, now I'm gonna create a folder folder name is my web open the folder new add a new file txt file name the text file is uh, add underscore deep in deep change the extension now I'm gonna convert it deep to HTML dot HTML just click on ok yes it's uh, converted to HTML file okay now open it with the notepad HTML tag close the HTML tag head close the heading tag and then border title title is add on our add deep tag within deep this tutorial is adding multiple deep in deep tag now body close the body tag now I'm just adding a deep tag deep style style equal to background color this is the main deep tag background color is blue and close the deep tag white set the white white is 100 percent and then height height also 100 percent okay now save and then just uh, view in browser yes you can see this is a deep tag with blue color what i said the background color okay now i'm gonna add uh, another deep into this deep okay this is the another dip and uh, the change the back color back color is red okay white is 70% uh, 70% means 70% of the first dip and height also 70% close the dip tag okay now I'm gonna add a hand heading tag h1 this is the first deep text d in uh, blue deep okay let's check yes you can see blue deep and the second deep okay now i'm gonna add third deep okay now just copy the deep and paste into this deep close the deep tag okay now this one is a uh, blue deep and this one is for red deep you can see red color and the third deep third deep is green change the deep color as green yes now save and go to the browser reload this page yes you can see a blue deep red deep and green deep but it's in the left line uh, now I made it in the uh, center okay now 100% full screen 70% 70% of the previous first deep 70% of previous second deep okay now align this deep tag in center to make it center just add code align equal to center reload this page uh, yes you can see its uh, position is now center okay it's also responsive you can check and this is responsive when you resize this page it's automatically resized now it's working fine thanks for watching this tutorial